Poor Smart. His hair's too long, and he's got to be pretty hot. So we've decided it's time for a haircut. There's no dog grooming place nearby. And besides, Smart is not really the type to want to go to a dog groomer. So Palin cuts his hair. My wife Pei Ling is one of these people that can do just about anything if they set their mind to it. And that includes dog grooming. She does it all by hand, with a comb and a pair of scissors. Very careful and meticulous. And Smart is very patient. He really doesn't seem to mind much. Smart is such a sweet dog. He's good with kids, he's good with other dogs, so it really doesn't surprise me that he's so tolerant about getting his hair cut. That's just one of the many things we love about him. We have these two cats that are sisters. Smart is kind of like a big brother to them. They fight and chase each other, but in the end, they're pretty good friends. Good boy. Toto. Toto. Of course, they have to nose around, see what's going on, and then settle in to watch the show. Good job, you look good. Smart, can you get up? Show us how you look. Come on. Yeah, there we go. We've got at least two more months of hot weather here in Taiwan, so he's good to go until the fall. We have enough dog hair here to make another smart. 